Hi everybody, today we're gonna show you how to download documents that you may have in an email in your Outlook and you have it as an attachment and you wanna download it to your Office 365 OneDrive. Well, today we're gonna show you how to do that in this really quick video. So we're here, you've just logged into your Office 365 account and now you have all your apps in front of you. Um, and we're gonna assume that somebody has sent you an attachment uh, in an email. So we're gonna go over here to uh, Outlook. Okay, now what I've done is I've sent myself, myself a, a email with an attachment. It's a Word document. We're gonna go ahead and click that on and we'll wait for it to populate on the right here. Now, as you can see, we have this little box here. This is the attachment. Now using your mouse cursor, I want you to navigate to the bottom right of the, the, uh, the square and you're gonna hover the mouse over this little down arrow indicator and it's gonna say more actions. So you're gonna go ahead and click that. Now you have three choices. You can preview it, you can download it, and, and we'll offer you to download to different locations or save it to your OneDrive. So we're gonna go ahead and save it to your OneDrive because that's what the workflow is. It is keeping all your work within Office 365. And I'm gonna go ahead and choose that. And it successfully downloaded. You can see the little green check mark right here, save to OneDrive. And then we're gonna come over to this uh, app launcher, this little uh, dot cl cluster over here and choose that. And then you're gonna look for OneDrive and choose that. And now you don't see it right away. Now where it's been downloaded, it, since it was an attachment, is in your attachments folder. So we're gonna go ahead and open that up. And there it is, the Mass Hire Remote Assistance uh, Request Procedure, a uh, Word document. So that's how if you get attachments on an email and you wanna get it into your OneDrive this is how you do it. So in another video, we're gonna show you how to actually move that document into a different folder and actually create a folder. So thank you for watching.